22. Day 22 of the lockdown here in Paris. Yes, it's long, but we believe you all deserve a very big reward. And for that, we have another red and blue news flash coming your way in English on this Tuesday, the 7th of April. Now, what's new in Rouge et Bleu? Well, Paris Saint-Germain and the club partner, all a core live Limitless, have launched their first ever FIFA Home Gaming Cup. That's to continue to do what they can for all our fans in lockdown who can now take each other on on that famous footballing game. That's right, we are planning four tournaments over four weeks with four winners. And just to add a little bit of spice, the four winners will play live FIFA matches against, wait for it, drum roll, Levin Kurzawa, Julian Draxler, Juan Bernat, and FIFA star and world champion Dax. That's the very best that Paris Saint-Germain has to offer at FIFA. And the matches will be shown live on Paris Saint-Germain's club media channels, but also on official club media partner, Be In Sports television shows. The tournament champions will also win their fair share of stunning prizes along the way, such as a holiday in Paris in an Accor hotel, or the full VIP experience for a match at the Parc des Princes, as well as countless other Rouge et Bleu gifts. Here are the upcoming tournament dates so that you can get involved. And the club is doing everything to look after its fans, those in lockdown like me, but also those of you who are still out working hard here in France, in Paris, all over the country, all over the world trying to make it as easy as possible for us to get through this difficult period. Whether you're working in a hospital, in health and safety, in security, or just in our everyday needs, first and foremost, a big thank you for what you're doing from the bottom of our hearts. And today, we want to pay tribute to you, our everyday heroes. Send us photos and videos of your personal everyday hero, dressed, of course, in rouge et bleu, send it to us via DM or to this email address. And after donating to the Secours Populaire charity and the Paris hospitals, the club is also supporting Action Against Hunger. To tell us exactly what is being done, here is Jean-François Riffaut. Bonjour. Les équipes d'Action Contre la Faim ont commencé à répondre à l'épidémie de Covid-19. En Afrique, en Asie, au Moyen-Orient, mais aussi en France, nous sommes présents pour aider les plus vulnérables. En France, par exemple, nous avons commencé des actions de prévention, de sensibilisation. Nous apportons des kits d'hygiène, des kits alimentaires et nous apportons aussi du soutien psychologique aux personnes les plus démunies vivant à la rue, vivant dans les camps, à Paris, en Ile-de-France et dans quelques villes de France. Pour ce faire, nous avons besoin de votre soutien. Nous avons besoin de votre soutien pour acheter le matériel nécessaire à la protection de nos équipes et à la protection des personnes que nous accompagnons, et bien entendu, pour acheter l'ensemble des kits d'hygiène, d'accès à l'eau, qui permettent aux personnes de se protéger. Je vous remercie infiniment de votre soutien, je remercie infiniment la Fondation PSG de son accompagnement, encore une fois, sur cette crise qui met les plus vulnérables d'entre nous en difficulté, et à laquelle nous essayons avec vous d'apporter la meilleure réponse. Merci beaucoup. Last week, we spoke to you about the online fitness challenges laid down by Law Boulot and Was Freestyle. Well, they've been mixing fitness, football and fun. That's the three Fs. And by all accounts, you've loved it. So thank you very much for getting involved and keep those videos coming. Midweek football means Champions League and the PSG watch party is back again tonight with another legendary European match that you can experience as if you were right there at the Parc des Princes. It's the night Paris Saint-Germain put Rosenberg to the sword with that record-breaking win and you can watch it on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook and Twitch. It's a very good excuse to stay home. We're doing what we can to make this lockdown as easy as possible and remember, 
The better we are at this lockdown, the quicker we will win this fight against the coronavirus and we will be back at the Parc des Princes watching football for real. So stay at home, enjoy the evening. I'll be back with another red and blue news flash very, very soon in English. Until then, how about we send out another happy birthday message to our very own Paris Saint-Germain World Cup winner. Who could that be? The other World Cup, the first one, 1998, Bernard Lamar, our fantastic goalkeeper who won the World Cup in 1998. Joyeux anniversaire, notre chat, Bernard. Abonne-toi à la chaîne YouTube du Paris Saint-Germain. Abonne-toi au canal de YouTube du Paris Saint-Germain. Abonne-toi à la chaîne YouTube du Paris Saint-Germain en cliquant ici.